Southwest 2937, stop. A frantic warning at DCA directed at a Southwest plane, which the FAA says had just received permission from controllers to cross runway four, while a jet blue plane was beginning its takeoff roll on the very same runway. A source says the planes came within a thousand feet of each other. Teresa Hoffman was on board the JetBlue aircraft. Like you're about to like lose the ground underneath you, and like right about that, like right before that's about to happen, like we just slam on the brakes. Thankfully, a potential disaster was averted, but now there are many questions about what might have caused the mishap in the first place. It appears that you had two different airplanes talking to two different controllers, one ground controller and one a uh, tower controller. So it appears to be uh, an operational error. Hoffman also received an email from JetBlue, which stated in part, this disruption is considered an uncontrollable disruption, meaning it's due to events outside of JetBlue's control. The FAA saying it's going to investigate the incident, and both airlines promising to cooperate fully with the federal government. Even as the FAA says runway incursions have dropped, a string of recent close calls have raised significant concerns. Southwest aboard. Like a landing FedEx cargo plane last winter, coming within 100 feet of a Southwest passenger plane about to take off that was carrying 128 people on board. So, Sam, the travel, the summer travel rush is on the way, and there are some issues when it comes to air traffic controllers. So how are they making that work? So the federal government right now, Hoda, is in the process of hiring up to 4,000 more air traffic controllers over the course of the next couple of years. There's a four-day hiring window that actually begins today, but this is no easy task, A, because of specialization, and B, controllers have to retire by 56, so you got to be under the age of 31 just to apply. Now, one controller from Minnesota told Texas Public Radio, if you're good at video games, you would likely be good at this job, but if you expect structure and repetition and the same thing every time, you probably need to look at another the profession. Hold it back to you. All right, Sam. Thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.